This is Mark Bell from Super Training Gym. Super Training Gym, the strongest gym in the West. Here today with Chris Duffin. Hey, I'm oh here my. to pick up some weights. Chris Duffin, whenever he comes down, he has to do something a little loony tune, a little bit crazy. We'll see what he's got on tap for us today. But he did tell me of some awesome goals that he has. He wants to squat 1,000 pounds and wants to deadlift 1,000 pounds. And not, not anytime soon, not but yes. <laughs> not today, but probably in 2017 or something like that. Anyway, I'm excited about it. I think it's cool. I don't care when the hell he tries to do it. I just want to see him work towards it, and it'll be really cool to see him actually accomplish some of that. So today we're doing some pulls with the wagon wheels here. Uh, partial range of motion deadlift. Why do you do a partial range of motion deadlift from time to time, Chris? Just working on uh, upper back development, strength to be able to uh, support and hold the bar in the position that I want it in. And sometimes it can be more fun because for a lot of you out there, you might be able to handle some more weight. So enjoy the video. Yes, fun. confidence here he's got the extra plate yeah that plate out before he even did this set so that's pretty cool you want 900 pounds on there yep here we go don't call it a comeback i've been here for years rocking my beers putting suckers in fear making the tears rain now like a monsoon listen to the face go boom it's over and overpowering over the competition we're towering records the money maker mic rod i think i'm gonna put that to use hi it's tradition to drink whiskey Whenever whiskey and deadlifts rolls into town, good old Chris Duffin, he's about to pull 900 pounds, hopefully for some reps. Here's to you. Boom. Oh, Cheers. Good effort. Oh, oh, oh. God damn! In there. The, something like, yeah, with a cable. Yeah. yeah. It's oh, great. Okay. Yeah, okay. yeah. Yeah, you didn't specify cable. When we were talking about the phone. Yeah. About that's up. what you missed. Yeah, we, that's, that's, a, that's a big, a big uh, fail on my part. The, well, and the big thing everybody misses is you got to do one side, then you have to do the other. Uh, yeah, that's the, I forgot to spell that out for you, too. Yeah, and you know, what I've been doing really is I've just been putting my feet up over my head, laying on my back, and so I've, I've been doing something totally different. I, now that you showed it like that. I feel like I've been doing, going about it the wrong way the entire time. And I'm like, not in position. Ah, fuck it. I'm, I'm strong enough to pull it. And I just went for it anyway. And then about, yeah, and then I broke up and I'm like, nope, I'm in bad position. Don't even try. It's gonna. Yeah, why does that happen? You freak yourself out with the bigger weights. For some reason, it's so different. Yep. Before you ever even get tension on it, it's different. Yep. Like I knew it before I even started. Mm -hmm. I'm like, eh, I'm just gonna do it anyway. Exactly. I've regretted that phrase many times. Eh, I'm just gonna do it anyway. Mike, what would you do to compliment that workout? A great beard. Yeah. Your biceps look great, smelling. Right. I'll compliment this workout all day long. I was kind of more referring to the like to complimenting the fat burning properties oh, of uh, deadlifting 855 for several repetitions. My main compliment to this uh, whole oh, ordeal. Yeah, yeah. Yes, you took down some whiskey. And, oh, I'm, <laughs> I'm over here. <laughs> I about it the whole time. Just over here, hammered, hammered, drunk in the front row okay. of a 900 pound deadlift. So you're turning your brains out over here. You knew Fired Chris Duffin was out. coming. You ordered beans anyway. What do you have to beans? say? Beans, no yourself? rice. 
just beans and meat. Well, you get safe. extra beans too? Yeah, I'm trying to shit my weight out. That's what I'm trying to do right now. You don't, you don't care. We have a guest. I, we're all men here. I'm not worried about it. Like, you don't fart, YouTube. I know you all fart. Get out of here. The entire goal of today uh, for myself coming to the gym was um, I talked to Mother Earth, made sure it was nice and hot, okay. so no one tore muscles. Um, I made sure whoever it was, one of these two, so you're away. No, no, look how warm and loosey goosey yeah. you are. You, I don't enjoy this. Did anything rip? I don't like you anymore. Nothing ripped. I mean, I never liked you to begin with, but I definitely don't like you now. I'm just, just saying. Nothing ripped. You had a great day. So, silent, silent Mike, off the team? Uh, he's off the team, yeah. You brought on the heat, and you did like some of the pussiest shots of whiskey I've ever seen. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, I'll show you! Oh, it went in my, it went in my mouth. <laughs> yeah. Sound like two more shots. Take all your clothes off and you'll pull 850. I can't even drive home now. I'm stuck at this gym for three hours because I'm hammered. I don't want to get arrested <laughs> in goddamn Sacramento. Thanks, guys. If I took one more shot, I'd probably be running streaking, streaking laps around this building. I'm sweating from every pore of my goddamn body. Why is it so hard to find employees that swallow? I mean, how, how hard does it really have to be? Jesus. Seriously. You're, you're providing whiskey to your employees, and, 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 they, and they do that. I mean, like... You... Mark, all I gotta say is, I see now why you're the second strongest gym in the West. <laughs> <laughs> I'm conf as confused as you guys are. I don't know what the hell just happened. I don't know what the hell's wrong with that guy. Pretty crazy shit. Unbelievable lifter. World class in the squat, world class in the deadlift, and just an awesome dude. It's always awesome having him here at Super Training Gym. Hopefully, as always, you enjoyed the footage from Chris Duffin. Make sure you check out the video of him teaching us how to deadlift, how to deadlift both sumo and conventional, and then obviously the proof's in the pudding on how strong the guy actually is. This lift is a little different. He's using some straps. He's getting drunk, and uh, he's lifting off of an elevated surface, but find what you like to do and stick with it and work on getting stronger. Keep it uh, pretty simple. That's something Chris has been doing for years. He likes to lift with chains. He likes to sometimes lift with bands. He likes to sometimes use straps. He's somebody that run, has run into multiple injuries over the years, but he doesn't let it stop him from lifting. He focuses on the stuff that he can do. He focuses on, is, uh, he focuses on the uh, the things that he's that he enjoys. He focuses in on the things that he actually likes to do, rather than like killing himself and focusing in on the shit that he can't do. He's instead putting his energy into the things that he can do and the things that he loves. You should be doing the same thing. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like it. Make sure you comment below. Make sure you subscribe. See you later. That's it from Super Training Gym. Thanks for watching the last video, guys. If you want more content, be sure to subscribe, like, share it. Leave your comments below on what you thought. If you want to see more content from the strongest gym in the West, be sure to click up here. And if you guys want the best gear in the powerlifting game, all the strength, sports, slingshot, right over here.